A big winter storm was barreling through the mountains on the night of February 23rd, 2012. Now I was at home just finishing up a late night dinner with my dogs putting away the dishes when I got a late night phone call. Now those late night phone calls sort of give you that sinking feeling in your stomach because they inevitably mean only one thing, that someone's in trouble. Unfortunately, my hunch was correct. I turned on my Mount Washington Observatory radio, packed my bag, and headed out for the base of the Mount Washington Auto Road. The drive through Pinkham Notch was horrible. The snow was falling at an incredible rate, the roads hadn't been plowed, and I wasn't sure if I was gonna make it safely to the base, let alone be able to help somebody else. When I get to the base of the auto road, I met our snowcat operator, avalanche rangers, and volunteers within the search and rescue community. Um, where we learned that not one, but three people needed to be rescued from the top of Huntington Ravine. I wasn't sure if these climbers were going to make it. The weather conditions were absolutely brutal, and I was wondering if we were going to get there in time, if at all. So we fired up the snowcat and we ventured off into the night. Seeing the return headlamps of the search and rescue volunteers come across the tundra at the 4 a.m. hour was a fantastic sight. Seeing the shadows of the three climbers with them in tow was more relieving than I could even possibly describe. On a night that seemed so bad and so brutal, they made it. We made it. And we made it because we knew what was happening on that mountain. We were successful because we knew the conditions. We knew the conditions on the summit. We knew the conditions along the Mount Washington Auto Road. And we also have the expertise with our meteorologists on the summit to know what was coming. Mount Washington Observatory's work is critical. Our instrumentation and our expertise have the ability not only to inform, but to save lives. That's why it is so important to support this unique and vibrant nonprofit organization. It's a cause that I believe in, and I'd really love your support.